Hey guys, this is the Canadian Baconer, and in this video, I'm going to be talking more about Battlefield 1. So very recently, I kind of just was sitting around, you know, looking at some Battlefield gameplay, trying to stay up to date with the latest news, and then this thing sort of snapped. Um, you know, something really popped into my head, and I was like, hey, wait a second, where is the trench warfare? So of course, when Battlefield 1 first got announced, everybody was so hyped, they said, oh my gosh, yes, BF1 is going to be set in World War 1, the theme is going to be awesome, um, I'm going to love the vehicles, the combat, you know, the weapons. Everything is going to get me engaged, especially Trench Warfare. And then here we are at a stage with literally no news at all about Trench Warfare in Battlefield 1. You know, I'm talking about like entirely. I looked up on YouTube and on like Google, Battlefield 1 Trench Warfare, I saw little to nothing. I mean, I'm talking about literally nothing on this. And this is really what's getting me upset or really concerned because what if there is no Trench Warfare in Battlefield 1? I did not get into the alpha, so of course, I don't know exactly what it feels like, but my friend did get into the alpha, and he was telling me how pretty much there is the only map that we can play on, which is Scar. Um, there is absolutely no trench warfare at all. He think, I think he mentioned like one section, but nobody goes over there, and the trench does not even last for that long. So I wanted to briefly compare it to another game that is basically set in World War 1 and I think really nails this whole aspect of getting the trench warfare down and also um, maintaining the whole immersion factor of World War 1 as well. So of course you know me, I'm always about immersion, I always want the game to look you know, amazing and have the visual weather effects really affect the way the game works and having all of the visual cues and Verdun does not have that. Verdun is a kind of ugly looking game. But it does really maintain the whole trench warfare gameplay and really gives you a taste of what World War One could have been like. It's got the realistic damage model. Basically, one hit to anything from anywhere gets you killed. So you really have to rely on the trenches, you know, to get you from place to place without getting shot. And that is awesome. That's what I feel like a section of Battlefield One should be like. Now, of course, Battlefield One is not meant to be 100% realistic. But I feel like using small elements from games such as Verdun will really add to it and really make the gameplay experience a lot better. Now I know for a fact a lot of hardcore shooter fans do want to have this element of realism and I really feel like that could be achieved through having trenches. Now of course, we are only in alpha stage, so maybe in the final release we're going to get like, you know, actual trenches or even in the beta we could get like a new map and stuff that could illustrate what they wanted to achieve. Maybe in Rush that would make sense in the beta, I could be wrong, but of course we don't know yet. My friend kind of gave me the idea of like using Verdun as an example because I think he really is excited about the game but I don't think it's coming to consoles and he, he only plays on consoles so that's kind of unfortunate. But yeah, I think right there that would add to the whole level of authenticity for Battlefield 1 and get more people involved. So like I just said, this could all be in the beta, this could all be in the final product of Battlefield 1, but uh, as of right now there was no news or anything on that, so I'm kind of concerned on whether or not we're going to have this. Now I'm not the biggest fan of Trench Warfare, um, ironically, but I really feel like adding that element would really push Battlefield to its limit and get pretty much all aspects of what I think a World War 1 shooter should be like. So I've got the weapons down, the damage model is good, you know, the character models look good, the visuals are awesome. Pretty much every little aspect of the gameplay seems awesome right now, but I really feel like adding Trench Warfare on top of that would make the game that much better. But let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. So were you really excited when Battlefield 1 was first released because you wanted to get in the Trench Warfare? Or were you like me, where you didn't care that much about the Trench Warfare and you just wanted the game to come out? Let me know down below. But yeah, that's actually going to wrap up this video. If you enjoyed, feel free to give this video a like and subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed already for more content like this. But thank you for checking out this video as always, and this has been the Canadian Baconer. Stay crispy, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.